Hello, good morning. I hope you all are doing well. In today's class, we will see about a structure of diapering. It is one of the very important, uh, one of the very important topic. Sometimes you may get the questions like, uh, for if you are in the BSc, you will get the question like, explain, explain structure structure of diaporin so this diaporin it is also called a banana pond banana pond means diaporin inside this diaporin you have a banana pond and it is 3c 2e bonding two center two electron bonding is seen in this uh, structure so this thing you have to keep in mind so this diporin diporin you have a diporin diporin is p2h6 right p2h6 it is a diporin so this is p p h h h h you have two boron And four six hydrogens so this was the simple structure that you, uh, you have studied right so in this structure we will discuss about the more detailed structure so the physical state this diporin is a it is a very it is a colorless compound in physical state physical state it is a colorless gas and this is P2H6 is an electron deficient compound so these two you have to keep in mind and most important thing is in this diporin, you will see about the three center, two electron bonding, and sometimes it is also called banana bond, right? Banana bond. Okay. Why it is two center, two electron bond, and why it is banana bond? We will try to study in this structure. So if you look here. You see, you see here, in this structure, I have written down. If you see this structure, you have a, you will see about 12 valence electron. 12, 12 valence electron you will see, right? You see this here. Red one, one, two, three, four. This boron B two H six, right? B two H six. So out here, this H two H. This H, I'm writing in the this color. This two H in the middle, it is called a preaching hydrogen, right? These are the these two hydrogen is the Preaching hydrogen and the four terminal hydrogens, these are the these two are the preaching hydrogen. Or let me write it P short form HP HP, right? So this these two are you have two of ele valence electron, two preaching preaching hydrogen. Four terminal one two three four four terminal four terminal hydrogen you have two preaching hydrogen and four terminal four terminal hydrogen so this preaching hydrogens in this two boron this two boron boron number one since you know that boron has a three valence electron, right? 
boron has a three valence electron this is the one 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 so you have a three valence electron out here also you have one two and three valence electron so six so all this hydrogen will carry one 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 electron right so one two three four five six so you have two of valence electron two of valence electrons but here here you will see a special type of pontin in this structure in all the terminal terminal hydrogens you have four terminal one two three four you have a four terminal hydrogens bonded with a boron it has a the normal normal bonding is formed between the hydrogen and boron hydrogen and boron hydrogen and boron one two you have four normal bonding four normal bonding right you have four normal bonding whereas here inside this if you see here since boron is only three valence electron because of this it, it behaves like a special type of bonding this boron hydrogen boron boron hydrogen boron this three bonding that means three c right this two three hydrogen boron hydrogen boron boron hydrogen boron it is bonded with only two electrons if you see here this boron and hydrogen is bonded with only one hydrogen uh, one electron here also one so you have in this three bonding two two types of bond you have only two electron out here also two electrons which forms a banana like banana like bonding right you have bhp bhp you have only two it should be four right but only two electron because of that it behaves like a banana bond if you see here hydrogen has s hydrogen has a s type of electron uh, it is one type it is a spherical in step and this boron boron it is a sp3 hybridization right and this this normal bond boron and hydrogen you have 1.19 armstrong in this it is a normal a bond angle between this and this from this bond to this the bond angle is 97 degree whereas in this terminal you have 122 degree and the in the preaching in the banana bonding the bond between the boron hydrogens is 1.23 armstrong so these are the very important points you have to keep in mind right armstrong yeah armstrong so boron has a sp3 hybridized because of that it overlaps with the hydrogen it, it, it is seen here in this structure i have seen here this boron boron has only three types of valence electron this is the one electron this is the one electron this is the one electron one two three if you see here also if you see here also you have one two three so it overlap and it behaves like a banana out here it is on here it is only two bonding bhp you have only two types of uh two electron is present in out here also you have two electrons it's something behave like a banana because of that it is a banana bonding so this 3c 2e this is a banana banana bond right banana bond we see here so the banana bond is uh, you will see in PHP PHP you will see only two electron inside this here whereas the normal bond in the, the normal bond in you have in normal bond you have two C two center you have only two center and two electrons are present two electron two center two electron so these are the difference that you will see but the banana bonding is bhp you will see only two types of uh, two electrons are present are la larger this banana bond is larger as compared to normal bond but stronger than in 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 strain of the bond 
the, the shorter the bone, the stronger will be the bone. But here, the special character you will see here is the banana bone is much longer as compared to the normal, but it is much, much stronger as compared to the normal bone. So this is the special character you will see in this bondin. Right? Okay. So, as I've told, this, this diporon, as we have just discussed, this diporon, diporon is an electron deficient compound. It has two poron and four terminal hydrogen and these four terminal hydrogen all are in the same plane. These four terminal hydrogens are in the same plane, right? But the prechain hydrogen in the middle, you have a two prechain hydrogen. The prechain hydrogens lie one is above and one is below the plane. Right? One is above and one is below the plane, the prechain hydrogen. The two prechain BHH BHP bond are as usual three center two electron that we have just discussed. It is a three center two electron, right? This the boron atom is diboron undergo sp3 hybridization as we have just discussed. The bond length of BH is one twenty three Armstrong. Whereas in pH terminal is 1.19 Armstrong. Outer also I've written here. This normal bond, bond pH bonding is 1.19 Armstrong, terminal hydrogen and boron. But this preaching hydrogen and bon boron, the bonding in the banana bond is 1.23 Armstrong. Right? So that these are the one. And some important points like as I've told it has 12 valence electron, it has 8 covalent bond, 4 bonds, 2 C, 3 are uh, 3 center, 2 electron, 4 bond, 2 center, 2 electron. See, it has a uh, 8 electrons as I've told. Boron has a 3 valence electron, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 6. So you have six hydrogen, one, one, one electron. You have two of electrons, right? Valence electron. So this two of valence electrons, you have four type of bonding in the terminal. This is terminal hydrogen. One, two, three, four. You have four terminal hydrogen. So these four terminal hydrogens, it form a bonding. When terminal hydrogen and boron is made, it is a two center two electron bonding. So you will see four bonding. Four bond, four bond in terminal hydrogen, and in banana bond you have one, two, three, four. You have four bond, four banana bonding that is three center, two electron. You will see three center, two two electron bonding. You will see in this uh, special type of bond uh, in banana bonding, right? So this this is uh, all about your. Uh, banana bonding structure of boron it's banana bond or tau bond also tau are known as three center two electron bond very important the normal bond pH hydrogen bonds are also called 2c 2e bond two center two electron bond the banana bond is PHP they are lot lar longer but stronger than normal bond so these are some of the special characters in so if this is the bond bh we have a bh bph right so when diporon undergo reaction with the 4 c c h right methyl chloride when four molecules of methyl chloride undergo reactions when four molecules of methyl chloride undergo reaction with the banana bond or with the diporin, this four terminal hydrogens is replaced by this. All of this hydrogen is replaced by methyl CH3, 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 CH3. So only terminal hydrogen is replaced 
since the bond between the bonding in this in this banana bond uh, bonding in this BHB in this BHB and BHB it is a banana like two center three center two electron bond in in this air it is a delocalization of the electron when the reaction takes place it against delocalized continuously delocalized right delocalized whereas this terminal hydrogens they are not delocalized but it can it they are localized due to that it is easily replaced in the reaction so when they undergo reaction with the methyl chloride this terminal hydrogen is easily replaced due to their localized properties localized properties and you get this compound so these are these are the properties and the uh, structures of the diporin it is very important you can please go through and watch the video i'll be sending you the pdf file after this class video i hope you you will like this video and if you have any doubt and problems you can kindly approach me so that we can discuss in the upcoming video thank you very much for watching the video